teacher is named Robert Crossland. He's been teaching here at Preston Junior High for several years. And according to some parents I talked to, feeding live animals to his reptiles in front of students is nothing new. What I have learned in the last four days is disgusting. It's sick. It is sick. Local animal activist Jill Parrish is the one who contacted police after a teacher contacted her last week about an incident involving Preston Middle School science teacher Robert Crossland. I'm not going to allow this to be swept under the rug because I know exactly how it works in small towns. According to Jill, it was after hours on Wednesday when Mr. Crossland fed a live puppy who was reportedly sick to one of his reptiles. He has a snake and a snapping turtle. Apparently, teachers could hear the puppy screaming from across campus, and it all happened in front of students. Allowing children to watch an innocent baby puppy scream because it is being fed to an animal, that is violence. That is not okay. I can tell you, we've got numerous calls, yeah. Franklin County Sheriff David Fryer says the department is looking into it. We're investigating the facts and turn over the prosecutor, and he's the one that will determine if the law has been broken. And the Preston School District Superintendent sent out a statement saying they're aware of a regrettable circumstance involving some of the biological specimens at Preston Junior High. He went on to say, while the district certainly does not condone individual actions that may violate district policy or reasonable expectations of behavior, we hope that any errors in judgment made by a teacher in this instance will not cause us to forget the years of care, effort, and passion the teacher has given to students in Preston School District. You can be a good person and you can be a good teacher. What you did is not okay and it is against the law. Jill, who had Mr. Crossland as a teacher herself, says this has been going on for years. She says he'll offer extra credit to students who bring in an animal for his reptiles to eat. And he says it's all in an effort to teach them about the circle of life. You have a teacher who is taking these kids in there and showing them this torture to these animals and saying, oh, this is so cool, this is nature, this is what happens in nature. How is Matt not screwing with these 12, 13-year-olds' minds? The superintendent tells me that Mr. Crossland is still employed here at Preston Junior High, and while the incident is under investigation, he has not been placed on administrative leave.